No. WFXR Sports. Good evening from the Berglund Center, where we are just minutes away from puck drop of a new SPHL season. But before that, the Rellier Dogs have one more piece of business to celebrate their historic SPHL championship. Tonight, they will unveil the banner here at the Berglund Center that will remind everyone of that magical title run the Dogs went on less than six months ago. Roanoke clinching the President's Cup trophy in this building against Birmingham, the first in franchise history, and lifting the banner ahead of the Dogs' seventh season is bound to be a moment to remember for the team and its fans. Sure it'll be a very emotional night. Uh, a lot of pride going around, a lot of a lot of energy in the building, and uh, you know it'll be an exciting moment. But uh, once that's done, we'll get the puck dropped, and you know we're on to a new year, on to new things. I know a lot of people are gonna have their families in town who are on that ice with us holding that cup. Um, it's just it's gonna be the cherry on top, I think, for the achievement that we that we had last year. Um, but I think it's gonna be short lived because as soon as that banner's up, a whole new season starts for us. So um, you know the message is gonna be, guys, soak it in, enjoy it. Um, but. Again, you're lining up against a guy who is going to be competing. you got to out-compete him. That's it. The Dogs set to host Fayetteville tonight as they begin pursuit of a repeat title. Puck drop is set for 7 o'clock and also happening tonight, week 9 of the high school football season. WFXR's Ryan Moy has a preview of our Hardy's Friday Night Blitz Game of the Week. Well, for tonight's game of the week matchup, it is Alta Vista taking on Perry McClure right here in Buena Vista. Both teams enter tonight's contest five and two on the season. This is the 15th meeting between the two with the Fighting Blues leading the series. This is also the first time both teams have met since 2014, where the Colonels came away with the 35 to 10 win at Alta Vista. Alta Vista have won the last five meetings. Now the Colonels had their five game winning streak snap last week after falling to Gretna 23 to 16. And on the flip side, Perry McClure won at home 45 to 12 last week against Craig County. The Colonels are currently ranked third in the region 1B, while the Fighting Blues are ranked fifth in region 1C. Now we will have more from tonight's game of the week matchup later on on Friday Night Blitz in Buena Vista, Ryan Moy, WFXR Sports. Ryan, thank you very much. So a busy night ahead, both on the ice and on the gridiron. We will show you how it all unfolds tonight on Hardy's Friday Night Blitz at 1030. But for now, reporting live from the Berglund Center in Roanoke, David Guzman, WFXR Sports.